Hey guys, this is Karthikeya Kantwal from Apex Finsa and I'm back with your daily dose of charts for tomorrow's trading session. Now today was a good trading session uh, from the equity side but uh, on the index side it was nothing special. We had a gap, we had uh, then some sideways movement but nothing in a clear sense of direction which could have made a lot of people money. So I guess it was a slow day for me. Let me know how was today for you in the comment section below. Moving on to what's new for tomorrow, starting with the first trade that we have on the equity side is a long on Hindalco, where we are going to go for a long at a resistance turn support at 250, stop loss at 247, ideal targets 1% on the upside. Moving on to the second one, uh, Sipla. Now Sipla right now, if you look at uh, the hourly chart, it's pretty evident that it's in a strong flat range with the lower part coming in at 800 and the higher ceiling coming in at 850. So we're going to go for a shot at the resistance at 850, stop loss at 850 and 860, ideal targets 1% on the downside. The third is Tata Steel where we have been trying to catch this movement since two days but it has been going slightly away from us uh, day by day. We had a long trigger at 615 or I guess it was 600 a couple of days ago and we missed that. This time we're going to go for a long at 625 uh demand turn supply sorry supply turn demand zone stop loss at 615 ideal targets one percent on the upside moving on to the fourth one now after quite some time we have introduced uh, once again a breakout trade where we had strong higher high, high low formations and uh, right now if i look at the immediate structure i do have a flag formation so we're gonna go for a long above 2740 stop loss at 2710 ideal targets one percent on the upside the final equity trade is on uh, reliance but contradictory to popular opinion we're gonna go for a short here uh, simple logic we have a demand during supply zone at 1975 which has been uh, rejected multiple times in the past so we're gonna go for a short there stop loss at 2000 ideal targets one percent on the downside now talking about the indices for tomorrow's trading session starting with first uh, nifty i told you guys nifty may we had uh, a lot of trade opportunities but sadly all those opportunities were wasted in the gap up that we happened uh, sorry that we had uh, today so for tomorrow we have clear set expectations short small short near 14700 longs near 14500 anything in the middle is uh, for small scalpers either to the supply or to the demand zone when i talk about the option chain i have immediate resistance at 14700 with 1.4 million added contracts Significant at 14,900 with 970,000 added contracts. Support comes in at 14,600 with 1.9 million added contracts. Significant at 14,500 with 2.2 million added contracts. Now, as you can see, the strikes on the option chain are in direct agreement with these zones that we have. So that is a really good logic that we have uh, for tomorrow. Right now, 14,600, 14,700 seems to be a good uh, trading range breakout idea to have let's see how it goes tomorrow when i talk about the pcr that comes out to be at 0.98 i believe yesterday or uh, it was uh, more than one so it is uh, better now it is decreasingly bearish which is a good sign now coming on to the second index bank nifty as you can see we have absolutely nothing to trade on bank nifty it is on the highs and highs only every pullback till 35 33 500 to 37 50 can be a nice potential buy opportunity or if you want to go for aggressive entries as soon as it breaks above 34 500 you can initiate new longs with the stop loss going under 34,000. it's a big stop loss but considering the uh, size of the move and the volatility of the move it is uh, needed when i talk about the option chain i have resistance immediate at 34 500 with 362,000 added contracts significant at 35,000 with 800,000 added contracts Immediate support comes in at 34,200 with 131,000 added contracts. Significant at 34,000 with 527,000 added contracts. Now, tomorrow, to be honest, on Bank Nifty, there is no valid trade right now. I can give you multiple trade ideas, but they will be forced. From an intraday trader's perspective, I guess Nifty is offering a lot many more opportunities right now, relatively speaking, of course. This marks the end of today's video guys. I hope you are liking the content. If you are, don't forget to leave a nice comment, like the video, subscribe to the channel and press that bell notification icon as well. I hope you have a nice green trading session tomorrow. Thank you so much for watching. Have a good night. Bye.